Hello, this is Core Tech Korea. The product we're going to talk about today is Brookfield's Small Sample Adapter. Small sample adapters are accessories used to measure small sample viscosity from 2 milliliters to 16 milliliters. It is mainly used when it is difficult to obtain a large amount of samples or when measuring expensive samples. You can keep the temperature of the sample constantly using a circulating water bath. For models with temperature sensors, you can check the temperature of the sample in real time. It can be mounted on Brookfield dial reading, DVE, DV1M, DV2T, and DV3T viscometers. The specifications of the small sample adapter vary depending on the viscometer used. The following is the specifications for using an LV type viscometer. The following is the specifications for using an RV type viscometer. The following is the specifications for using an hot type viscometer. The following is the specifications for using an HB type viscometer. The components of the small sample adapter are as follows. Today, we will explain the model with temperature sensor included. Today, we will explain with DV to T viscometer. Rotate the screw at the top of the locating channel assembly, clockwise to combine. Attach the water jacket to the bottom of the locating channel assembly. Turn on the power using the power switch on the back of the main body. The screen displays the phrase, remove spindle and level the viscometer. Make sure that the spindle is disconnected and the viscometer is level, then touch the next button. Proceed auto zero for a while. The auto zero compilation message is displayed. Touch the next button again to go to the measurement waiting screen. Combine coupling nuts, extension links, and spindle. Attach the coupling nut to the coupling screw. To prevent damage to the pivot, lift the coupling screw slightly upwards when the spindle is engaged. With the coupling screw slightly raised upwards, rotate the coupling nut clockwise to engage. Put the sample in the sample chamber as much as the sample quantity of the selected model. Attach the sample chamber containing the sample to the water jacket. Combine the sample chamber from bottom to top in line with the groove in the water jacket. Connect the temperature sensor connection cable. Connect the constant temperature water bath. Connect the hose to the nipple on the water tank and constant temperature water bath. Set the temperature of the sample using the constant temperature water bath. Combine the insulation cap. Select the mounted spindle and set the rotation speed you want to measure. If necessary, you can set the measurement end condition. Press the run button when the sample reaches the set temperature. The screen shows the data from the sample that you are currently measuring. Each displayed figure represents measured value, torque, shear stress, shear rate, temperature, speed, and trend bar. Touch the stop test button to end the measurement. When the measurement is complete, remove the insulation cap. Then, disconnect the temperature sensor connection cable. Remove the spindle. When removing the spindle, hold the coupling screw upwards. Remove the sample chamber. Clean the separated spindle and the sample chamber sufficiently.
If the measurement is not displayed and E is displayed, reduce the rotational speed and measure again. If the torque value is less than 10% even though the measured value is stabilized, measure again by changing the rotational speed. Make sure that the temperature of the sample does not exceed 100 degrees Celsius. If the spindle is impacted, the pivot is more likely to be damaged. The measurement error can occur depending on the sample quantity, so please keep the correct quantity. All right, that was a description of Brookfield's small sample adapter. For consultation and purchase inquiries, please contact Core Tech Korea. Thank you.